Hey guys, it's Chica Conroy. We are back from more Earthbound. Alright, so. Right in here we can um, optimize our equipment a little bit better. So we're going to do that right now. Um, I'm probably going to show the slime generator in the next fight though because in the last part I said I was going to show in the next fight what it did and because I cut it you guys didn't see it. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Well anyway, um, we got the Mr. Baseball bat, I guess companion with Mr. Baseball cap that was earlier in the game so we're going to go in by that. Oh great. Um, I'm actually going to cut this here so I can sell some of the sprigs of parsley and some old equipment so I'm going to be right back. Um, nothing important alright so any of you guys are using this as a walkthrough just see it as though you're selling some food items and uh, and uh, old equipment that you don't need. Alright I'll be right back. Okay and we're back. Alright right here we're just going to buy the uh, Mr. Baseball Bat from Ness of course. Just going to optimize our equipment right here. We got ooh, another 12 on our offense. Yes, take the minor league bet. I'm just going to try to keep us as optimized as we can be. Uh, deluxe frying pan for Paula. Okay, we got 10 more on the offense. Get rid of the thick fry pan. We all have something good as a silver bracelet, and everyone but Ness is something as good as the coin of slumber, so we're going to go ahead and do that, even though Ness is already a freaking tank. Just can buy the hard hat. Okay. That is it. Okay. Uh, we're going to be heading out. Now, the road's all blocked up over here, so we can't go there, so we're going to have to go around. Now, as you can see, we're sweating because we're in the desert and everything. Um, you're going to want to uh, be careful with that, though, because uh, you actually can get uh, sunstroke. It's a condition that'll happen if you're out in the desert for too long and you're sweating like that. When you get sunstroke, we're all playing rough. Man, we haven't seen those in forever. Um, when you get Sunstroke, uh, you're going to lose a little bit of HP every so often. And you can heal it with uh, Healing Alpha, actually. It's not really that bad, though. But um, if you find a wet towel item, that's what it's for. There's a monkey. Go, 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 go! Welcome! <laughs> Paradise exists beneath this hole. Go, 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 <laughs> Talarama is great and kind. <laughs> Whatever. And he knows everything Talarama does. Underground rooms. Now we're going to go down in here, but... You know, obviously this Talarama guy must be of some importance. You get it, Talarama, spoof of Dalai Lama, but whatever. He's... Meditating. He's fasting now, and practicing silent meditation. He's sick or smelly. Don't bother him. Alright, so... This area is useless to us right now, we can't do anything. Um, this part is actually going to be more of a side quest part than anything else, to be honest. Let me uh, come back here, Magic Butterfly, please. There's also going to be a really cool enemy that I'm probably going to show off if I can find one. They're pretty rare, and they're hard to find. And when you do find them and everything like that, they are a little bit annoying to encounter. Oh, a double burger. Alright, it's introducing us into more, you know, better versions of items that we had previously. Alright, now, as you see, I'm just going up along the side of this, which is where you want to go. All right. Oh, a Skelpian. It's like a Skeleton Scorpion. Yes, they have PK Thunder. Oh, whoa, dang. Yeah, you might want to watch out for that. They have very little HP, you know, considering I'm a little optimized in this part. So, yeah. Just watch out for them. So they got Thunder, and I believe they can also poison you, which isn't good. Alright, now, right here, we got this lone pixel right here. And an enemy. Two enemies. Great. Alright, the Smiling Sphere, I'm going to just tell you right now, you want to be careful when fighting them because they explode. When they, when, as soon as they die, they'll instantly explode. Now Paula heal herself. Protein drink. And, uh, Jeff. Eh, Jeff, you can shoot. Edge closer. Whenever enemies edge closer like that, that means their attacks are going to do more damage. Paula usually goes first. Let's use the bread roll on her just to be careful. Yes, I still have a bread roll. Alright, it's gonna explode! It does mortal damage, but you save yourself from pressing the uh, A button fast enough. 
So yeah, just to warn you about that, just wanted to show that. God, Paul, you have like no HP. Seriously, I have finished the game before with Paul only having a little over 200 HP. I mean, she is like that weak. Alright, now let's talk to this lone pix right here. Why would you be talking to a tiny black sesame seed like me? I want to apologize to that white sesame seed that I hurt before. If I could just see her. And guess who it is to commemorate this moment of talking to a sesame seed? Fix your stick and instantaneously, I'm a photographic genius if I do this on myself. Okay, get ready for instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, see, fuzz of pickles! Wow, what a great photograph. will always bring back the fondest of memories. Yes, we've heard this all before. Alright, now we gotta find the white sesame seed. This is a little side quest and everything I just wanna show. What the heck are they doing? We sleep in the desert, so I'm mistaken for corpses, but a corpse doesn't usually wear a bathing suit, does it? Hey, stop staring at my tan lines. Go away. <laughs> Pretty witty there for you. Okay. Yeah, I just wanna take care of these enemies fast. Give him a taste of his own medicine. Thunder. And you missed. Oh, come on. They both missed. And, of course, his hit. Oh. Deflected lightning. Oh, man. Now we're going to waste a PSI power. That was like 14 PP down the drain. It didn't work. Oh! Oh! First, we have a PSI power miss twice. Jeez. Now these UFOs dodging our attacks again. I mean, that's present. Hey, there's boil egg. All right. Oh, well, I got a level up. Speed went up, of course. Typical. Max PP went up by five. I guess that's good. Okay. This book is here. They're. If I remember, they don't really have anything that threatening. It's mainly just the UFOs that you can get annoying though, because your attacks tend to miss quite pretty often. Okay, I'm gonna have to lay off of using the PSI after this though, because seriously, it's not working well. Okay, that's exactly how I wanted it to work. Yeah, we're running low on PSI, and it didn't work again! The love of God, enough with the attacks missing! This is like Peaceful Rest Valley all over again. If you guys remember me yelling that one time, I missed like four times in a row. We got a cookie? What a useless item. Alright. If I remember the other sesame seeds down around here. I think. Big Battle Rocket, that is a great item for Jeff, seriously. That will like one hit pretty much anything in this part of the game. I'm not kidding you. It'll, it'll pretty much one-hit bosses, well, some bosses, not all of them, obviously, not like a sanctuary boss, but, you know. You know what I'm talking about. That's Jin's headquarters, finding buried gold. And we got Sunstroke, somebody. Of course it's Paula, because Paula always gets killed, because she's a lamer. Whatever. Sunstroke was cured. This hole's great. Good hole, good hole, good hole. First, someone asked me to dig buried gold. I began to feel like I was obligated to find it. Man, I'm starving. Do you have any food you can spare? Yes. I have a lot of stuff. What are you going to give me? I'll give you the boiled egg. Because I want the double burger for later. My gold, I'll give it to you. Wow, what a nice man. This hall doesn't have anything worthwhile to us right now, so we're not going to go in there. And uh, we're actually going to cut this right here. I'm going to have to look for the white sesame seed the next part. So, um... If you like this video, subscribe to our videos up in the corner. Big yellow button. Give me a 5-star rating down below this video. And be sure to check out my other parts if you like this one. Okay, I'll see you guys later.